If you collect enough tokens on the back of special packets of Cocoa Pops, you too can send off and become Prime Minister. Oh. <laughs> I hardly need to tell you, Prime Minister, it would be extremely damaging if this government were to be found selling arms to Iran. Well, but let me show you that's not what I was doing. Then where did the Sunday Times get this story from? Excuse me, Prime Minister. Look, dear, he said he didn't do it, so he didn't do it! <laughs> Honestly. You don't want a backbench rebellion on this, Prime Minister. There's already talk of a leadership challenge. Such a stirrer! <laughs> Sebastian, thank you. <laughs> Robert, you have my word on this. Very well. I shall see you at Prime Minister's questions. Sebastian, would you show the Chancellor out, please? <laughs> Just because you want to be Prime Minister. I do not. You do. She does. <laughs> Sebastian, would you lock the door? <laughs> Come over here, please. <laughs> I have something rather private that I need to show you. Yes? Something... Uh, quite sensitive. <laughs> it could be potentially very explosive. Oh, Prime Minister, I want it so bad. <laughs> it's this file. Oh, yes, this file, yes! I want this file so bad, yes. What is it? It's an intelligence file that I need you to destroy for me. Oh, OK. Arms deals with Iran. But you just told the Chancellor there were no arms deals with Iran. Yes. You lied. Yes. But I thought you were perfect. <laughs> I need you to shred this. But if this got out, it would... Sebastian, please. Just do this favour for me. Of course, Prime Minister. But first, Prime Minister, <laughs> how about you do a favour for me? <laughs> Don't forget the bottom shelf, Prime Minister. 